Hello everyone and welcome back. I just thought I would do a little sit down and chat video because I've not done one of them you know, in a little while. Um, and I'm going to, sorry I'm just going to fix that light. I don't know if it, I need like an extra light. I'm trying to do it from a different angle because um, I'm going to be recording a what I got for everyone for Christmas video because I know that you guys really love them. I have my Christmas jumper on and everything just to get into the festive spirit which is exciting. Um, but yeah there's been a lot going on so I just kind of wanted to have like a little check-in and see how you guys are also. Um, I finished working at Primark um, not last weekend but the weekend before so that was the 5th of December which was my last day and you know like I'll pop a picture up here like you know they got me there was a lovely card with such lovely words and you know like they got me some lovely gifts and it was just so lovely um to kind of end that chapter there because I've worked there for two years and that shadow of my like body is not fun so I'm really sorry if that's like distracting I'm trying to try other ways of filming too just because there's going to be lots of stuff and I'm not really sure how to do it. So it might start off this way and might end up another way. It might be me on the floor or something. But yeah, so I have been working from home with helping, helping my mum with her business. Um, just to like help her get some stuff done because she kind of has started some work with Hibernian Football Club. She is helping them with the players and stuff but she's still able to do her own business but I'm just there to kind of like help her um get things done and whatnot and um, so it's exciting and it means that I have more flexibility for like acting stuff and um, so that is exciting but it's really tiring because I have to take Lucy my younger sister to school and pick her back up and then try and do everything else in between like sort of the house like whatever sorry like I feel like I look a mess um but yeah so that's what's been happening and it's been kind of like a tough couple of days if I'm being completely honest as well because we had like a sudden death in the family Um, like I'm, I feel like I've processed it a little bit and I'm okay for the moment but grief is like a funny thing where it can kind of come in waves like you might feel okay right now but like in five minutes time or in an hour you might feel completely different so I'm kind of just taking it hour by hour rather than day by day because you know it's kind of a roller coaster because it's also on the 22nd um, of this month it will be my grand three years anniversary from when she passed away so it's all quite close um, together so I think that's why it feels quite like overwhelming and stuff um, so yeah it's been a lot to process um I was supposed to go to an acting thing yesterday but I hadn't seen my mum um because it was my auntie who passed away but I hadn't seen my mum because they went to go up and see my grandma but I had just got to Greg's and by the time they were leaving like I wasn't going to make it in time to go with them so I just wanted to be there for everyone and it was just quite an emotional thing because it was so sudden it was like really hard to process um so yeah, I don't want to go into too much in case I do start crying, but that's what's been happening. Um, I think I mentioned that I was filming for a student film that was a comedy and we finished wrapping that a while ago. Um, just need to wait to see it and hopefully have some footage for a showreel. Um, so that is exciting. Um, I also have, with the, the acting thing that I was talking about that I was supposed to go to yesterday, because today is Monday the 14th, some 13th, I think. I don't know, the 13th or 14th. I don't know. The days are kind of like all muddled together at the moment. Um, and I'll probably get this in a few days and I'll put my other video out. Um, so that's kind of why I was going to try and edit a video last week. But because of like trying to do the school run and stuff, it just wasn't happening. So it's now just trying to find the balance of when I can post and edit videos and stuff. So it might take a while for things to get back into like a routine, but I am trying to figure it out. Um, so yeah, I have an acting project that I'm going to be a part of in January. It's a pilot for a sitcom. And 
so yeah it's very exciting and I'm really looking forward to it I forgot to tell them that I was going to film which is I set up the lighting for the video and I was like you know what I'm just going to sit down and do it now while I'm here um so they were like showing me I'm like just give me a minute <laughs> um but yeah like I kind of just wanted to get these videos done because I'm really ex I mean despite everything I, I want like apart from that like I was really excited for Christmas and I still feel like I'm still sort of excited so I kind of want to get this video done so that I can you know hopefully still feel in the Christmas spirit and get everything wrapped because I am stressing out with how much rubbish well not rubbish but like just all the stuff that's kind of accumulated like I have stuff over here under my t my um, dressing table there's stuff in my wardrobe and I just really want to get them like wrapped and in gift bags or whatever or like put in bags with their names on it or put them under the tree if we have space but where my mum put the tree now like I don't think there is enough space to put them all there but there's no gift bag so hopefully I could put some under or just put the bag of gifts there I'm like oh, I just don't want them in my room anymore um so yeah I can't wait to start wrapping so I feel more in the Christmas spirit um oh sorry I just knocked you guys <laughs> I didn't mean it um but yeah so it's exciting for the sitcom pilot um I can't wait to see what the script looks like and who I'm gonna be and like know who I'm gonna be playing and things um because I don't know that because I would have found out last night but obviously unfortunately I wasn't able to go um so I will still be doing like my Christmas videos at first I wasn't sure if I should do them because of everything that's happened but I know that my auntie wouldn't want me to stop doing things just because of her passing away if you know what I mean and so I'm trying to like think about that and obviously with my sister youngest sister being 10 she really wants to do the videos because she really enjoyed them last year and I did enjoy watching them back last year like the Christmas Eve Christmas Day vlog and um, I'll obviously try and plan it out a bit more because that was the first time doing it I obviously didn't have like a plan but yeah that's kind of what's been happening and um, it's kind of been a very hectic month of December you know start ending my job at Primark which is very very toxic um and I'm so glad I'm out of there because they were very dismissive of my anxiety for a lot of the time because we were very short staffed as I had mentioned previously and they put me on tills for the whole eight hours of my shift and because we were so short staffed I was on tills by myself for four hours um, and the queue was huge and it like triggered my anxiety when you're stuck in like those little cubicles because of the screens because of covid which obviously they need to be there to protect everyone but I'm just like you've triggered my anxiety with this now and it's going to take a while for me to un kind of learn that anxiety that's been associated with that but they weren't very understanding until like obviously before I left it was just not a very nice situation so I'm glad to not have to deal with that anymore and um, I also do miss the people because they were all very nice but yeah the whole like that side of things was just not fun and I do feel a lot happier with not being there um, and not having to get up really early on the weekend um, just have to get really early during the week that's the only problem <laughs> but um, I think I have gone into sort of a routine other than today because obviously I just feel quite sad um, like kind of like an emo emotional roller coaster but grief is a weird thing and I don't like when people are like oh you'll get through it like well you will get through it but like, when people are like you know oh well there's like another side to it like you kind of just learn to deal with it and like find ways where it doesn't affect your day-to-day -day life and you kind of have accepted you know that's what's happened and you kind of like move on but it's not like you've moved on and you don't miss the person you kind of moved into like a space where you're, you're not as affected by it every single day like obviously grief will hit you at random points like I still get really upset about my grand passing away or my papa you know like I still get upset about that and it hits me randomly like there's it's not like consistent but it can hit me randomly and you know it's just going to be a process of just trying to like maneuver through it um so yeah that was my little talk for today um just so I check in and update you guys but yes I will try and find uh more of a routine to post more regularly and oh god I'm so sorry for yawning <sighs> the tiredness it's gotten better not gonna lie but it's still annoying because I'm still like yawning all the time and stuff but anyway yes um I just thought I'd give you guys a quick update and I will try and find um a routine and a kind of schedule for things to be more 
um, frequent again and like act, me be more active and stuff but it's a bit difficult with work and stuff so it may just be more like maybe record on a Friday and then like upload on the weekend but we'll just see how it goes because there might be times where I may not have as much and I might be able to like edit a video that I've maybe previously recorded because I still have quite a few videos like seven videos I think that I've got left that I've pre-recorded maybe it's not as much as that now but um I might just have to keep getting those out just until I'm able to sit and record some more videos and um, I might try and record some more today if I have the uh, mental battery to do it um but we'll just take it day by day this week um because obviously there'll be plans for like the funeral and stuff so we just have to like see how it goes but I haven't I just want to say like I haven't given up on YouTube like I still love like sitting talking to the camera like showing you guys things you know like doing reactions and stuff I just have to find the balance again because obviously my job's changed I'm more busy during the week um but obviously that might change um, depending on things so we'll just see how it goes but I do plan to do you know like if I have like days off where I go somewhere whatever like to vlog and stuff because vlogs really do make me happy like I love like vlogging my day and like spending it with the people I care about and love so you'll probably have lots of vlogs and obviously if people don't like the side of the channel like that's okay too like I'm not gonna get mad but I just want my channel to be what makes me happy and music drag and sitting talking to you guys like doing like reviews of things and doing just whatever like that just makes me happy so like I'll just continue to do what I do on the channel and yeah I will try and be more consistent but I'll keep you guys updated and I'll speak to you guys soon bye